Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to look at 5 things spotted from Arsenal training. Arsenal returns to Europa League action this evening with the first leg of their round of 16 clash against Olympiakos. So the first thing on the list is Alexandra Lacazette shocked, disgusted and weirded out. As you can see in this picture, Alexandra Lacazette is looking weirded out or disgusted by something that he has seen with his eyesight. And it might be something that we as Arsenal fans would not be able to look at because it's something that will remain private with the Arsenal team. But we can see in this picture that Lacazette has found it something disgusted, but then he seems to see the funny side of the uh, incident as he seems to laugh it all off but at the same time at the back of his mind we will know that he's feeling disgusted about this situation but we seem to realize that there are things like this that happen in the Arsenal training ground that some people will find really really weird such as the party incident by brushing his teeth um, in the training ground there is something here that we will never know why Lacazette has been shocked out so the next thing on the list is Kieran Saini is the odd one out and faces punishment. The temperatures in England have been very cold at the moment and you got the likes of Kieran Saini wearing a t-shirt and shorts in a weather you would say is for jumpers and jackets. But when it comes to Kieran Saini, he is someone that just does everything with shorts and shirts and he's something about his blood that makes him be able to withstand the cold surrounding him and the Scotland International was the only one not wearing a jumper and he's making it clear that cool temperatures do not bother him the slightest but he would have been bothered by the fact that he was treated in a manner where he had to do a punishment in the form of a push-up. For an ordinary man like me, doing 2-3 push-ups is difficult but when it comes to Kieran Saini, someone that's also facing the cold at the moment and Aubameyang revealed once in an Arsenal video that sometimes the cold does get to him so we never know if he's suffered from the cold but at the same time he had to suffer with the push-ups but at the end of the day for someone like a Kieran Saini who's a full-on athlete this won't be nothing but that's something that we should be aware of when it comes to Kieran Saini that he keeps to remain the odd one out. So the next thing on the list is excellent spirits. Although Arsenal will head into Thursday evening's first leg with Olympiakos off the back of the disappointment of drawing 1-1 to Burnley at the weekend, the confidence and spirits within the Gunners appears to be high. With the likes of Granit Xhaka over here in this picture is smiling even after the mistake that he made against Burnley and that hasn't haunted him during this training session. During this session, the players appeared to play some sort of a game that brought about no shortage of smiles and laughs. While it is the results that do the talking on the pitch, Arsenal supporters and of course, Arteta will be pleased to see that there is a sense of unity and belief within the camp ahead of a game of such magnitude. The Gunners of course know that the Europa League is their last hope of a trophy this season, meaning the pressure will be on from the very first whistle against Olympiakos. But with confidence running very high as we can see in these pictures, it could make the task a lot easier. And we can see that there are a few key players that are making sure that the spirits are remaining high and making sure the players will enter the game against Olympiakos and face one of their old rivals and play some sweet revenge. So hopefully oh, the Gunners will be able to take these spirits into the match as well. So the next thing on the list is Willian impresses in training. And we can see again that Willian has started to show signs of why Mikel Arteta signed him in the summer transfer window. As we saw against Burnley that he was one of the top performers and he got the assist again for Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and he's starting to show signs of why Arsenal should be celebrating the signing of Willian and it turns out hopefully that Mikel Arteta has made the right decision in getting Willian 
but he's starting to show signs of progress and he's starting to show that in training as well. As you can see, in this picture, we got Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang going for a high five for Willian. And that means, or a handshake for Willian, and this means that he was somewhat amazed by what Willian done on the training session or something that he did on that particular drill. You can see the sense of um, excitement by Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and he's really happy to see his fellow teammate starting to show signs of his abilities and starting to show signs of why Mikel Arteta wanted him at the Gunners. So the final thing on the list is Lacazette and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang's bromance remains high. Lacazette and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang are now both fighting for the same spots against Olympiakos. And it's Mikel Arteta who has a tough decision to make to who he would choose between Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and Alexandre Lacazette. But as we can see in these pictures, the spirits between Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and Lacazette remain high and we can see that the friendship is more important than who starts against Olympiakos. And that's something that's important because if there's problems between players, then at the end of the day, it's going to prevent confidence, and it's going to prevent excellent spirits, and it's going to end up running through out the match against Olympiakos. But as you can see, these two experienced, mature human beings are showing that friendship is very important, and just because of a game and a competition between the two players, it doesn't prevent other the two players from having arguments and problems. And that's something we should learn as well as human beings, that these two players, even though they're fighting against each other, show such respect and humility between the players, that's something we should follow. And these players are role models, in my opinion. Hopefully both Lacazette and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang get on the score sheet for the Gunners, but, and hopefully they can help this team to a crucial win against Olympiakos. And these are five things that were spotted by me in Arsenal training. But other than that, guys, remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.